Hello and welcome everyone to the Limitless Careers Week. Hi everyone, um, I'm delighted to be on the call today. I'm joined by four fantastic speakers from all over science. Thank you everyone and uh, I see that the questions are basically popping off. And are you in the hospital at the moment? Yeah, you can see the ugly curtains behind me. That's how you know that you're in a hospital, I think. <laughs> it's scientifically known that science is better with a diverse workforce. It's for me quite exciting and I suppose one of the big things I've I've loved as I've started my PhD is just seeing the breadth of applications. I'm investigating large day occurrence in the entire Atlantic, so you can see the Atlantic here. The more I learned about physics, the more I realised that physics was a way for me to find the answers to many of those questions that I've been asking myself and others since I was a kid. Everything comes back to giving the best type of treatment to the patient. If I was to build a robot, what would I need to know? An example of what I'm doing is, you can see, I've got a crawler there. And of course, we're all worried about the robotic uprising of uh, you know, 2025. <laughs> no, <you're not. laughs>